thing is, is that this really takes you believing in your jujitsu in order for this to work. But believe me, the more you believe in that your jujitsu works, it's gonna work better for you. Okay, same thing like with a with a takedown. You can't just high fast it. You really gotta believe that it's there. Or like a judo throw, you can't be like, oh, maybe. No, it doesn't work like that. Okay, so I'm pulling here, here, and now she's tucking it. And then you go. I can pull this here from I'm here. Rotate around. Push I'm it. Just gonna pinch my knee okay. and turn my hip. Grab and knees together, and I'm gonna be off. flat. But my left hand is still but pushing in the pocket. Okay. Here, as I come up here, switch, okay. and I'm tilting so to the right. In. I don't need to hold it now. I'm so holding with my right hand. Yep. Control. And I scoop with that one. Okay. Right hand comes uh, under. And then, once I'll get that, then we're going to start all the way over to the Yes. Yeah. But look, if I'm this, okay. so it doesn't work. Because this is all yeah. pressure, like here, and my foot's going to crash. Here. Side control. Yeah. yeah. It's all trapped. Yeah, I'm trapped with my hand. Because I'm squeezing. She's on her back. My shoulder with my leg. Okay? But it's not just dangling here. It's literally here. And this is every, everything's space. engaged. And I'm leaning and to the right. I'm pinching yes, his far hip Should with my left side. hip. And I'm sitting Asian off to the left. Hip. It's literally, Still I'm getting my left. My, my right hip off the mat. If you notice, with that foot, if this foot's dead, so your hip mobility is limited. So you're going to go a little bit faster now. Professor Jerry says, instead of 20 miles an hour, you're going to go 30. 1, 1,000, 1, 1,000, 3, 1,000, 4, 1,000, 5, 1,000, 6, 1,000, 7, 1,000, 8, 9, so, uh, and this knee here, here. it's the hand off to this group. So that way she can roll up and down. Can you try to grab your leg as you're stepping into the ball? Can you what? Can you what? I can, He's you asking can if I can stop your leg by reaching over to grab this step. So that's trying to run here. On here. This <laughs> you try it, Trevor. <laughs> Ryan. And then Ryan, sorry. Try to pull Okay, here we go. All right, so he's here. Yeah. So what do you what do you say? So you're gonna do the move. It's as you step back over on chair. Here, just roll. Yeah, once you roll on. Yeah, on the back step. Yeah, on the back step. Let's get the arm and then let's put them all together. He's asking if I can stop here, which I'm gonna put myself right into a triangle. Or that. Yeah, I mean, that's all right. It's a little tricky. Let's try this. But remember also. Is that what he's going to really fight for is to free this arm. That's what he really is going to fight for here. Look, selfish, here. So as I'm taking here, if he fights with this arm over here, that's when you potentially have a triangle. But the key is, I don't think you have to stay on top. So if I lose that arm, I'm just going to be transition a mountain or a side control, but I want to stay on top. So we're going to let go of this. So look, hips up and I'm pulling. He pulls back. Look, my elbow is up as I swing down here. I need you up here. Look, from here. If, if I don't properly tilt here, here, let's see. 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 let what makes you want to initiate the sweep instead of coming up to the finish on the, on the block? If, it, if you're afraid you're going to roll out of it, you can go the sweep. If he frees this arm, if he takes the hand out of the pocket, then I have to just stay on top and begin over something. Okay. Maybe some of this. That's good.
So look, the key here is hips. Okay, look, I'm gonna elevate my hips because I can reach down here. Even if he keeps his leg on the mat, I can reach it here. Okay, look, swing that elbow over here and my hand is in the here. And I keep putting it in my pocket here. Okay, go to your feet to the left. Okay, so I, I came up and I keep this here. Because okay. I can also go this way and get the side control. But if I tilt to the right here, I can let go with his, with my left hand. Okay, if he begins to fight out of this and pulls his arm out, I'm here. Okay, what would you do here? Look how low you're staying. Look at that. And I'll stay here. I want to just be on top. I don't want to roll the Yeah. Possibly if I get a triangle or something like that, but I want to stay on top, 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 top. Because this is the sweet to get to the top. All this extra stuff from the top is just extra bones. The key is to get to the top using the normal block. Okay? So I'd rather you guys even just do this. Look, I'm pulling this right here, but don't keep your leg down. Look, I'm pulling this here. My hips come up, and I hook his leg. Two, we here. Straighten, look. Over here. Instead of going this way, you're going to go this way. Oh, and three, actually the first thing you did. No, it's like, maybe from here even, I have a mount. Because the knee is literally right now. Because you can even go from here, put that leg here, and you immediately go, like knee on the belly. And mount, and then I'll explode. Okay. So just get to the top, get the side start. That's it. One, two, three. This helps my hips turn.